Welcome back to In Pit Lane. Well, the local motor racing series, at least the circuit racing scene, is just about ramping up. But, uh, you know, I've said over the years, it's funny, Australia is the only place in the world that seems to think that motor racing is anything other than a summer sport. Thankfully, one area of the sport that has come to that conclusion pretty quickly is speedway racing. And our guest tonight will be in action this Saturday night at Avalon Raceway as part of the Great Southern Showdown for sprint cars. He's also currently leading the Victorian Sprint Car Championship. Will you please welcome Brett Milburn. Brett, welcome to Inpit Lane. Thank you very much, Brett. Now, I said you're part of that circuit that goes around. You, uh, your theme song could be I've Been Everywhere. I mean, you guys do travel, don't you? How many rounds of the State Series have you had so far and where have you been? Oh, so far, we're up to uh, round 11 this Saturday night at Geelong. Um, we've travelled to Mount Gambia, we've travelled to Hamilton, Moama, um, Warnable, Avalon. We've done a few rounds already, so... Uh, also Simpson, so we, we've done a fair bit of travelling, but um, not not too much out of the state. Just you know, we've hit the borders of Mount Gambier and uh, New South Wales, but at the moment we haven't travelled, you know, up to Queensland or over to Adelaide or anything yet. The thing is, we were talking before the before the show came on about the the strength of sprint car racing in Australia. We've got the the Great Southern this Saturday night here in Victoria. There's also major national sprint car racing happening in Western Australia. There's meetings happening probably on the same weekend in at Parramatta or somewhere in New South Wales, somewhere in Queensland. You're getting big big fields at all of them. How many uh, how many sprint cars are competitive sprint cars running around at the moment? Oh, look at the moment, they'd have to be in excess of 150. Like, you know, we had near on 70 at Warrnambool uh, in November. And at the same time, I think they had near 60 in uh, Sydney, Parramatta. Um, there could have been another 20 up in uh, Queensland and also, yeah, head over to Perth where they are this weekend and there could be another 40, 50 cars there. So, you know, the numbers are real healthy in Victoria and in Australia and spring cars just seem, yeah, they seem to be booming at the minute. And they're not, uh, it's not like it's like cut price, you know, budget motorsport. I mean, these are these are the, sort of the Formula One of, of dirt track racing. And, and you can, can make the comparison with Formula One, can't you, in terms of just how much power you guys have got and your weight with the Formula One cars? Yeah, and look, that's they do compare them with your Formula One. Like, it is the Formula One of Speedway, your oval track. Um, you know, it's, it's your elite sport for um, Speedway racing. And, yeah, your power weight, like your 650 kilo to your 890, 900 horsepower, so... You know, it's it's pure horsepower. You know, you put your foot down and you go in places in a hurry. So it's um it's very exciting and it's exciting for the crowd too because they can see everything and you know the crowd also love a bit of action with bumping wheels and roll over here or there too. The, the things are sort of made, I suppose, in a way to, to crash. But we have seen some extraordinary uh, some extraordinary crashes just uh, just recently. You uh, you had any bad ones this year? Uh, this year, look, we've been um, we've been good this year. We've stayed out of trouble, which is a uh, that's helped us uh, hugely with the uh, series and just being consistent and trying to finish every round we go in. And, you know, although we haven't performed as well as we want to with some of the bigger shows, all the local stuff we've done and all the local scenes and the state scenes we've been uh, really good at and consistent. And I think we've finished every round so far inside the top ten. So, you know, if we can keep finishing. But, you know, they are built for safety now. You've got a big chrome molly chassis around you with um, aluminium wings. And, you know, I've had a rollover this year, but nothing too major. Yeah, a lot of people would say the rollover was pretty major just in itself. Well, yeah, look, at you know, you can have a soft rollover in a spring car. Spring cars are designed, um, it's a big aluminium airfoil on top and it's pretty much like a big pillow. If you go over, that thing just, you know, compresses up and it takes all the uh, inertia out of the car and really makes it a, a light one. But in saying that, there's been a lot of big crashes where, you know, the, the wings will get ripped off and them guys are doing 180, 200 kilometres an hour yeah. and head on into a concrete wall. So this, uh, this is coming Saturday night. Uh, who who will be your main competitor competition out there? Oh look, there's you know there's plenty of competition in Victoria. Victoria is extremely healthy. Um, there's a lot of young guns with Corey McCulloch and Jai O'Keefe. Um, there's also Danny Pascoe, he's your last start feature winner. Um, Johnny Vogels has been extremely good at Avalon this year and took out a Victorian title. Um, so there's plenty of guys. Um, look, it's not going to be easy any which way you look. And when there's 45 plus cars every week, you just got to go as hard as you can and. Thankfully, I've had guys that have just been giving me a great car and um, getting it set up and just making us consistent and locking us into the show. You've also got the fact with so many cars there, I mean, you get a lot of actual track time, a lot of races. How many how many races do you get over the course of the night? Generally, uh, we go out, we do hot laps engine starts just to get the cars warmed up and get a base set up on the car. And then um, we'll have two heat races. The way the Victorian format's set up, it's sort of set up two heat races where you draw an invert. So we could end up a front and rear or middle, middle. And then you'll have a C, B and A main. So if you don't accumulate enough, don't accumulate enough points in the heat, you'll end up in a C or a B. 
and then hopefully you can work your way forward to the A and get up somewhere at the front of the A. So in terms of you winning the uh, the championship, what do you need to do? How, how close are you to having it all wrapped up? Oh, look, at the moment we've got a little bit of a buffer, but it's not over till it's over. And um, we just want to keep going out there and doing the best we can. And um, at the moment, if we can run top fives, top tens, it's probably going to ensure us the championship. But at the same time, we'd like to have a good enough margin going into Warnable, the second last round, that we can just go to Simpson and hopefully be just racing for a feature win and not have to be thinking of a championship and trying to conserve. Of course, uh, just just quickly, uh, if people want to come out on uh, come out on Saturday night, uh, where where is the track? Where can they find it? And about what time? Um, Avalon Saturday night, obviously, it's just in Lara, just off the Princess Highway there. So, um, uh, hot laps and engine starts will probably kick off about five thirty, and then hopefully racing starts at seven, um, and hopefully all goes to plan, and we have a smooth night's race, and it should be all over by ten thirty, so the uh, kids and the uh, adults can get home to bed. Yeah, well, it's a great night out, and as you as you said, one of the advantages is that you know you can see everything on the track. They don't sort of disappear for sort of twenty five minutes and watch it on a big screen. It's it's all in front of you. So if you haven't been to the sprint cars, if you haven't been for a long time, get out there this Saturday night at Avalon. Brett, best of luck for the rest of the season in your championship uh, quest. But for right now, thanks for joining us in pit lane. Thank you very much.